Hey guys, what is up and welcome back to the channel. Welcome to CJ. Today we have something exciting. We're going to be finding out where CJ Green is going to be playing for NBA 2K22. Our first start. We're going to, we've got the NBA draft. It's exciting. We're going to find out who drafts CJ Green. Before we get into today's video, I just want to say thank you for all the support on the previous videos. If you guys are new, please hit that like button. We're aiming for 150 likes on every single video. And also, I want to announce today, we're going to be doing a giveaway. I'm going to give away NBA 2K22. All you have to do is comment down below your favorite NBA team and your preferred console version. You have to also like this video. You've got to be subscribed. So get involved. Now, we do need to change our suit. Um, I'm also doing a giveaway on the Instagram, so there's going to be two separate giveaways, one on this channel, one on the Instagram. So all you got to do is comment down your favorite NBA team, your preferred console. You have to like this uh, video, and you've also got to be subscribed. Man, CJ is ready for the NBA draft. Let's get our outfit that we brought in the last video, our nice white out. Man, CJ is absolutely bald. Oh, look at Sheesh, he's looking good. It's time to find out if CJ Green is drafted. It's time to find out if we're a lottery pick. I've been seeing... Um, if CJ isn't a lottery pick, he actually has to shave his head. Don't worry. CJ is going to be styling. It's time for the NBA draft. Hey, look. I know we wanted to keep your draft party low-key, but you don't have to look like you at a funeral, bro. Mm, not funeral exactly. I'm, I'm getting more of a dentist waiting room. <laughs> Yo, I can actually see that. <laughs> yeah, you know, doesn't want to be there. Bro, but bro, knows bro, we get best. it. Y'all got jokes. We get it, man. <laughs> man, look, we just try to loosen you up, yeah, bro. I'm man. good. I'm good, man. This is just an eerie feeling, bro. This is the biggest day of my life. And we just sitting in my apartment like this is just some other day. It's not, bro. My whole life's about to change. Are y'all not understanding that? Nah, I get it. You you probably need some food. You want, you want me to Ricky, get you some water? Stop playing, <laughs> no, wait, wait, bro. Wait, wait, listen, Chill listen. out for a second. MP, I feel you, bro. Okay, because I remember when I first got that call from Barbara that I was hired, and I knew my whole world was about to change. And I'm sitting there in my boxer shorts, Netflix paused in the background. <laughs> hey, yo, what was you watching? I'm, I'm looking for a new show. It don't matter. <laughs> like, the point is, is that knowing your life's about to change and living it, two completely different things. This whole moment's all contrived for the cameras, but the real deal is walking into that training facility for the very first time as an NBA player. That's when you're gonna really feel it. You see, it hit me when MP was in middle school, but I'm used to waiting for the whole world to play catch up. I mean, that's kind of my whole thing. Yeah, you got enough for talent, I'll give you that, Rick. You know, I always liked you, Charles. And just so you know, I am keeping a list of everybody that got drafted before you because yeah, this, yeah. this is disrespectful, bro. Yo, Ricky, man, chill. This is exactly what we expected. MP still going in the first round? You gotta just... Man. All right, yeah, but I'm just saying, you know, he bulletin board material. All right, man, just don't stress out the client, man. Management one-on-one. Thank you, bro. You rattling the talent, homie. Right. Hold up. Mr. Lesser, sir, how are you? Yeah, I got him right here. One sec. Hello? MP, Harvey Lesser here. Congratulations. You're the newest member of the San Antonio Spurs. Thank you so much, Mr. Lesser. It's an honor. Happy to hear that. Now go celebrate. We get to work soon. Absolutely, sir. Thank you. With the 12th pick in the NBA draft, the San Antonio Spurs select MP. I'm in the NBA. That's the basketball league, because you know those guys are pretty good, right? I'm in the NBA! You in the NBA! I'm in the NBA, oh, baby! Yeah. Yeah. Hey, let's go! Congrats, MP. Your whole world's about to change. Hey, yo, hold on, hold on. It's Everybody great. get together. We got to get a picture for the hey, player. Yeah, come on, hold come on, on, come on, come on. Come on, look cool, Charles. Hey, low blow. Let's go. Hey, three. Right, what that look like? What that look like? No, no, no. We gotta take it again. Charles, look cool, hey, man. He's always cool, a liar bro. like no, 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 Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, more man, cool. come on. You got this. Go, 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 ahead, go. Come on. Three, two. Ah! Okay, that's it. That's I need it. that on my socials right now, I bro. I got you. I'm a pro. Chop, chop, oh, Ricky. Whoa, whoa. You a pro, but you ain't gotta chop, chop me, bro. I chop, chop whoever I want, bro. Uh -oh, All right, chop, uh -oh. chop me again. I'm gonna make sure those hands never chop, chop. Oh, you go bite the hand that feeds you. Look, I knew you didn't have no book sense, but I thought you had some common sense. Hold on, hold on. You got a better grade than me once. In our entire lives, bro. Yeah, but I sold the dopest pillow in home. Heck. Uh, 
Yeah. All right, you did. I ain't gonna cap. Neon stripes, though. Yo, those stripes go hard. <laughs> and you know what? You guys could be the next Jesus and Miro if this basketball thing No, 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 Charles. No, 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 no. Don't gas this dude up. He Don't make him think he's funnier than what he is. Do you see what I have to deal with, bro? I pour so much love into him, but it's just a one-way street. Hey, maybe it's more of an odd couple kind of vibe. But hey, either way, we can handle that. What do you guys think about a reality TV show? Charles, pump the brakes, bro. Let me start my NBA career first, okay? Oh, yeah, yeah, it's probably a good idea. Let's, let's do that. You in the NBA! Ah, 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 let's go, baby! Ah, let's go! Ah, what? Ah, what? Oh. So CJ is going to San Antonio. Yes! CJ Green is going to join the San Antonio Spurs. We will take, I think, pick 13 or 12 in the NBA draft. It's very exciting. CJ Green is an NBA player. The San Antonio Spurs welcome another Aussie. And you know what we've got to do. We've got to head straight to the NBA store, and we need to rep San Antonio. Now, there's been a few things happening with CJ since he was drafted. You guys are going to find out in today's video. I mean, it hasn't been the smoothest draftee process for Green. Um, I don't know if Green is that happy in San Antonio. We haven't even played a game yet there, and they're already talking about trades and that kind of stuff. You guys will see more about that, but we have to go rep San Antonio. We were just drafted by the Spurs, a young and upcoming team. CJ can go and be the man. Now, I don't know if I'll stay in San Antonio. We don't know, so don't you panic. If you guys want to see me on a certain team, don't you worry. That is still going to happen, but like I said, if you want to get involved in the giveaway, please comment down below your NBA team, your preferred console version, and you've got to be subscribed and like this video as well. We're aiming for 150 likes. CJ Green is a spur. Green. CJ is a spur. Man, I actually, I, this is like the most fireest team that I could honestly pick CJ being on. But CJ Green is heading to San Antonio. We are ready to go. But like I said, there has been some troubles. Do San Antonio even want CJ? Did they even draft CJ to, to come on board? I mean, to, to, to be a long-term pro... Uh, uh, I don't even know, to be honest. You guys will find out. We're going to talk about our apartment. I am looking at upgrading very, very soon. So let's see what our... Uh, what Basically, so let's see what's on offer hey, for us. Uh, I got to talk to you about something. What's up, bro? Well, look, as much as I love sharing the shoebox with you, I was thinking maybe we get ourselves something a little nicer. You know, now that you're in the NBA. Just bro, a thought. What you talking about? This place cozy. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, cozy, suffocating. It's plenty of things you can call it. Okay, so tell me this. Whose money are we using? Oh, yours. Mostly. Seems like a great deal for you, huh, Rick? For, for me? Well, you want me to sit here and explain all the things that I've done for you in my life? Well, let's start with the fact that, one, I'm your manager. The man that works day and night to get you more business opportunities that, oh, that's right, make you more money. Honestly, the fact that you can sit here and try and Ricky, act Ricky, like I'm Ricky, trying... Ricky, 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 get out your feelings, bro. I was just playing. Yeah, well, there's truth to every joke, MP. Okay. Hey, look. Hey, hey, look at me. Look at me. I'm so grateful to have you in my life. Can we move on now, bro? Dang. Yeah, yeah, we're good. Right, so what you looking? What you find? Oh, don't worry. I'm going to find this in the apartment. I'm going to furnish it, set up utilities, the whole nine. Hey, yo, and make sure we got natural light. This place kind of dark. Oh, and make sure it's not so claustrophobic, and we need leather couches, for sure. <laughs> yeah, whatever you want, MP. Ooh, foosball. Mini machine. Are you trying to live in an arcade? Because I just don't think that's the best look for a single dude. I, I, don't worry about me, bro. I'm going to be fine. Yeah, I'm not so sure about that. Look, I'm going to handle the apartment, and I'll let you know when we got an update. Okay, so hopefully soon we can get a new apartment, but our agent actually has to talk to us. Something urgent has come up, and this is what I'm talking about. You guys are going to see... I don't even know if San Antonio drafted CJ on the basis of keeping him. Now, I don't know what's going on. Don't you worry. We are all in on San Antonio. There is no uh, there is no ill ill towards them at the minute. I haven't even played a game from. We haven't even reported to the training facility yet. But we're going to go meet with our agent. We're going to go find out what is up, uh, what is going on. Because like I said, I'm confused. Green. CJ is confused. Now, I actually, we actually went, what, pick 12, pick 13? Pretty crazy considering how bad we were in the G League. It was probably like the worst uh, opening to a career. But we're at our agent's office. Let's find out what's going on. Let's find out what the smoke is about. And uh, let's get into CJ's career and uh, let's meet with the agent. MP, welcome back. So great to see you again. How are you? Excited for your meeting? We're very excited to have you on board. What was your name again? Oh, Adriana. Adriana, right, right, right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I bet you're pumped for your meeting. I've heard Charles have some great things planned for you. That's, that's exciting. Okay. <laughs> well, he's in the conference room if you want to head on in. 
He's expecting you. Awesome. Thank you, Adriana. Yeah, you're very welcome. So I was a little confused going into this meeting. We're about to find out what is going on. Um, it was It's saying basically it's urgent that CJ meets with the agents. So if you guys want to see another video, please hit that like button. Please get on board with the giveaway. I'll be giving away a copy of NBA 2K22. Let's get into this meeting. Let's find out what this commotion's Hold about. On, Listen, man, we need to talk about something. Why you look so pressed? Am I in trouble? I wouldn't call it trouble exactly. Watch this. I have one issue that I need to address like the numbers on the house. And that issue is MP. Let's talk about MP. I'm hearing his coach isn't a fan. Thinks he's more into fame than actually hooping. And I got to say, I agree wholeheartedly. You, hear, you ever hear of an NBA player with a YouTube channel? Michael Jordan didn't have no YouTube channel. LeBron James don't have no YouTube channel. Let's get serious here, people. I'd be shocked if MP starts a game this year. This coach isn't starstruck. He's going to make MP earn every single minute, as it should be. But hey, maybe I'm wrong. All eyes are on MP now. Is he going to fold under the pressure? If I'm Harvey Lesser, the GM who overruled his coach, I'm up at night sweating all over this. Good luck, Mr. Lesser. You and MP are gonna need. So what, Charles? Look, that's that's Pert. He always talking about something crazy. There's some truth to this one, though. So when does that air? It airs tonight. I know a guy. Wait, Charles, what you trying to tell me? I'm, I'm in the doghouse or something, man? Well, there's some truth to it. You weren't coach's first choice for the draft spot. He got overruled by Harvey, so here we are. And let me guess, you you know a guy who told you that, huh? It's my job to know a guy, MP. That's how I get actionable intelligence to help my clients make the best decision possible. But this not making sense. Coach, we've been cool. He's been treating me fair. And plus, he wouldn't publicly antagonize me. You know what I'm saying? He's been around a minute. Coach know how to keep this on lock? Listen, it might be a while before you get some serious playing time. Okay, there's a lot of egos involved here, and Coach is not the type to back down. Charles, you trying to tell me I'm not about to be playing because I'm on YouTube? That's crazy, bro. I'm less sure that that's the real issue, but for whatever reason, he's not your biggest fan. Front offices aren't always 100% and, alive. And, and, and what's a while before real time? You got options, okay? Starting with being the good soldier. Show up to practice early. You stay late. You listen to what Coach is asking of you, and you deliver. What's the other option? Go to Harvey Direct. Let him know that you're not being utilized. Or go public. I mean, every choice has pros and cons. It just depends on how you want to steer the narrative. I don't know about all this drama. Look, I just gonna I wanna keep my head down. I wanna play ball. Well, the upside is that everyone will see you as a good guy. Yeah. You know, doesn't rock the boat. The downside is they see you as passive, someone who doesn't want it bad enough to fight. It's a lot of head games for somebody still trying to get their feet wet. Well, it's okay by me, but just know that if you don't play this game, there are consequences too, good ones and bad ones. You need to go into this with your eyes wide open. You mentioned going public. What'd that look like? I actually think that's a good option for you. Oh, this is your favorite one, huh? It's not my favorite per se, but it does suit you in a lot of ways. I mean, you're a massive young talent. You're being held back by someone who is letting their personal feelings get in the way of doing what's right. Yeah. Now, I'm just getting to know you, but that doesn't seem like something you'd be silent about. Oh, uh, no, you're right. Okay, so what's the strategy? We going to media tour? Take the socials, you know? A tweet saying you should play more, and then we just let the machine do what it does. <laughs> let the machine do what it do. Hey, you got a wild streak, Charles. I, I like that. Well, you know, nothing brings things to a head faster than controversy. Controversy. What's good for the media machine is not what's good for ownership. Now, ownership's gonna wanna know why that young, high prospect is not getting playing time because his coach has a score to settle. Now, you might get branded in a certain way, but if you wanna move things quick, there's no better option than a general public nudge. Yeah. So I feel like you're most excited about the social thing. <laughs> well, I mean, don't get me wrong, it would be fun, but it's just one option. I mean, in the end, you're gonna have to choose what's right for you, both as a person and as a public figure. 
I can't make that decision for you. Look, if coach winds up being the issue, I deal with that. But it's too soon to be complaining about PT time. I just got here, man. Then all you got to do is just be the best MP you can be. You sound like, you know what you sound like? You sound like one of them old army PSAs. Be all you can be. <laughs> <laughs> Look, man, all I'm saying is if you want to do the good soldier thing, that's fine. But no complaining. No acknowledging frustration with coaches' decisions. Yeah. None of that, okay? Yeah. You got to be the good guy all the way or else you'll earn a reputation for being a fake. Look, understood. All right, that's what we'll do. Man, we haven't even played an NBA game yet, and our front office is already putting out these kind of rumors that CJ doesn't want to be here just for basketball. Man, this is crazy. We actually were drafted by the Spurs, a very interesting draft choice. Um, I honestly didn't pick CJ going to the Spurs, but you tell you what, we're, we're going to take it on board. In my next video, we'll have our NBA debut. We'll do some more upgrades. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Make sure hit that like button. Get involved in the giveaway. What do you guys think of CJ being in San Antonio? Is he going to be there for the long haul? Or is something going to happen with the franchise? Because I'll tell you what, something is not right with this draft. I feel like they've drafted CJ just to move him on or trade him. So we'll find out what's going on. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Stay blessed. And always, I'll see you in the next one.